It's gonna blow! Ah! Ooh, ah! <laughs> oh, wow, that was... Sorry for your ears. Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to some more Star Citizen, ladies and gentlemen. Today's video, uh, as you can see by the title, is all about the org event that we're having tomorrow. We're doing a race tomorrow. We're back online, ladies and gentlemen, to do a race. And I, as I mentioned in the last Star Citizen video, uh, there's a location that I want to go to. I want to start off here at Lawville, Gate 1, and um, end at the crash satellite. But I don't know exactly how far that is or how long it's going to take. Um, so we're gonna do we're just gonna go do some scouting today We're gonna head over to the crash satellite see the distance between that and where we are currently And then we'll head to Edmund and see the distance between Edmund and where we are currently because between Edmund and here uh, It's 30 minutes race. Um, so we can see the distance. You know what I mean? So what I'm gonna do is we'll go get the gladius because that uh, it's a pretty quick ship in the uh, in the atmosphere here And we'll we'll head over to the crash satellite. I've been there once That's it so we should be able to find it again, um, I'm hoping. So anyway, um, let's get out of here. So we're here, like I say, at Lawville. So I need to go... Well, first of all, let's get over to the uh, to the ship retrieval console. Let's do it. All right, guys. So we just retrieved our ship right here. But I just wanted to make sure I said this before we uh, get into the rest of the video. Um, so for tomorrow's org event, we're going to try getting these things done. So it gets very difficult um, when obviously like the admins or the community managers are having to pull people... Uh, mid-race that are, you know, watching the stream that want to get in. So if you do think that you are going to want to take part in this race tomorrow, in this org event, please make sure you get into Discord beforehand. Like, jump in tonight, jump in, ask questions tonight, um, see what you have to do to get into it, because we're probably, we're going to try not to um, be pulling people during the stream, because it just takes people away um, from being in-game, trying to get this org event all up and uh, running smoothly. You know what I mean? If we have multiple people, just new people coming all the time. Because you have to be a part of the org and all of this stuff. So just make sure you jump into Discord. The link is in the description. Um, you'll see all the information and everything in there. Ask questions now so that tomorrow we can start the stream. Um, perfectly. Nice and smoothly. So the stream should be starting. I'll probably start the stream about 10.30 a.m. Uh, Pacific Standard Time. And then the org events will probably start around 11 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. So just keep that in mind. Um, but yeah, make sure you jump into Discord. Link it, like I say, in the description. I appreciate it. Your, what is, why was that word so difficult? I appreciate your faces. Let's get to the ship. There she is, the Gladius. It's been a while. It's been a while, old beauty, since I've been running around in this bad boy. In this little badger. So the reason I'm taking this ship... Why am I underneath the ship? <laughs> the reason I'm getting in... Can you see my face? Hello? The re... <laughs> the reason we're taking this ship, like I say, is that it's really fast in atmosphere. And I need to get to this location, the crashed satellite ASAP. Um, like I say, I've been to this location once before, and it was fairly easy to find, but I'm just going completely off of memory of been there once before. I'm not gonna... If I can't find it, I'm gonna have to obviously look up a tutorial or something, but um, we're, we're just gonna straight up try and do this off memory. I think I believe... Well, I, I know where it is, okay? I know where it is. Um, so I'll meet you guys... Well, you know, let's just get up into the atmosphere so I can show you guys where it is too. Oh, this ship's fantastic. This ship is fantastic. Okay. So what we'll do, we'll just get a little bit of height here so we're not going to get freaking autopiloted somewhere. And then we'll, uh, you know, let's go up a little bit more. But I think right about here should be our location. So if you want to know where it is... Well, first of all, are we even going to find it? There's, I haven't found it since the new Planetech, so it may even look completely different. But when you're looking at Lawville... In this position, right here, um, right above the spaceport. It should be, from memory, right over this way. And luckily, oh my god, this thing, oh my god, this thing is so sensitive. Uh, it should be just over this way. So that's where we're going to head. So let's, uh, let's get out of here. I've been playing Space Engineers yesterday, okay? The control... <laughs> this thing seems... I mean, this ship's pretty sensitive anyway. But anyway, this is the direction that we're going to be headed. Luckily, like I say, it is daytime. All right, let's make sure we're going this way. There we go. All right, let's see if we can find this bloody thing and not crash. All right, guys, so I found it. <laughs> it took me longer than I thought because 
the terrain has changed since the last time I was here. With the new planet tech like update and everything they've had, it's different. So it's difficult to find. So you can see I've been using my scanner. And sure enough, on my scanner, uh, we found it. It is different. So I'm excited to actually go take a look at this thing. Because I haven't been here since the old planet tech. So it's definitely in a different location. Um, so let's just go and uh, let's go check it out. V2, 3.8.2, where are we at now? <laughs> but anyway, this is the new new location um, for this. So I'm excited. This is where I was thinking about doing our race to. But this has changed so bloody much. Let's just go ahead and land right here. Now, there's a lot of things that I have said, you know, with these new Planet X and all of that. Um, like some of the things I preferred before they updated it. You know what I mean? I used to love Edmund. I used to love... There was a bunch of places that I thought were gorgeous on Hurston. And since the update, I just don't think it's as, uh... Uh-oh. Oh, no, we're on Hurston. Thank God! I almost forgot my helmet. Uh, <laughs> but no, there's a few places that I thought were better before this new, um, planet update. Um... So, I don't know what this one's going to be, but let's uh, let's go take a look. I can already tell you, I think I prefer the old one. The old one was in, like, a field, and it was very, you know, beautiful. I mean, first of all, the bloody weather. We've been having a storm here since I bloody logged into the game, okay? <laughs> they need to cut back the storms, please. I love having weather, like, variants, but I just wish it wasn't as consistent as it is. Like, it literally... You could see... The sun's going down, right? Or is it coming up? I don't bloody know. But you literally... It's just... Ugh, it's too dark. Too dark. Alright, anyway. This, I think, could be a good location for our race to finish. Because we can spawn all of our cyclones over at Gate 1 on Lawville. And then we can finish right here. And it's a good place to finish because a lot of the times people are like, Where's the finish line? Where's the finish line? I mean, this... Pretty much shows you where it is. We got smoke and flares and everything. Well, not flares, but we got fire and smoke. Yeah, this has definitely changed. I don't know what's going on over here. Why it's smoking. We're definitely going to have a little look, though. It's nothing to do with my ship. Why the hell is this place steaming? I mean, it's cool. Don't get me wrong. Is it stopped now? No? Steaming? I don't know. Okay. Let's get back to this wreck. I'm actually... I... I have never seen anyone... I've seen no videos of people coming here. Since this planet update. And it does look... Pretty goddamn sick. Wow. I mean... Tell me this doesn't look incredible. But I think this is going to be our location, you know, for our race end. I've got to see how far away it is, because I've not a clue. <laughs> but I think this, I don't think it's too far. Hopefully it's not too far. Maybe it's going to be a long race. By the way, let me know in the comments so we know for tomorrow. How long would you like the races to last? Like, how long? Like, 20 minutes? 30 minutes? 40 minutes? 50 minutes? 60 minutes? Let me know in the comments. Because I don't know how far away this is yet, but let's explore it a little bit more. I mean, it looks... This time of day is actually perfect for this. I mean, it looks sick. Like, the graphics. Big fan. I just don't know if I... You know, I don't know if I do prefer this one or the old one. The old one was greener. But this one, it sounds incredible. You can't really see much. Like, you're in the fire. You know what I mean? Like, in it. But it looks goddamn cool. <laughs> Oh, wow. Okay, let's continue. I don't think my light... I don't have a light on my head anyway. Because I remember the intro of my old video. I'll play it right now if I remember. But I started here, and I was literally... Like, run! It's gonna blow! Run! Ooh, ah! <laughs> oh, wow. That was... Sorry for your ears. But that was my intro. If you haven't seen it, I'll play it right now. Ah! Everybody run! It's gonna blow! It's gonna blow! Everyone get out of here! Ah! 
See, I'm not, I wasn't joking. <laughs> I lost my, I've lost my mind. See, you think I'm crazy now. I was, I was crazier back then, I think. All right, let's get back up here. But I think this could be a good spot. I really do. I think this is where we're going to have to do it. I love it. I think they've updated the details on it, too. It looks like. It's very eerie. I mean, this time of day, I think, just helps out a lot. Maybe this crappy weather does, too. The fire looks sick. I can hear the beepy beeps. What did I just do? Alright, we've rebooted it. We're not on a mission or anything. You know, I was told there's a mission to come here. But... I, since I've been playing this game, I've never had a mission uh, to come to this location, if I'm being honest. So I don't know. I know it was one back in the day. I'm just saying I don't know if you can still uh, get a mission over here. Don't get stuck is the last thing I bloody well need. But it looks cool. It still looks cool as always. I enjoyed it the first time and I'm going to enjoy it the second time. Wow. Well, this is cool. So this is where our org event is going to be ending. I hope it's going to end here, okay? I don't care if it's a five-hour race. <laughs> I do. I don't want it to be too long, but this place is just sick. Listen to those sounds of things creaking. It didn't sound like that, did it? Yeah, I don't know, but yeah, this is cool. This is cool. I like it. It looks pretty cool around here. It's bur everything's burning. Yep, okay. Let's, uh, let's continue. So what I need to do, actually, let's get back to our shit. Look at the embers! When I move, it looks even better. Tell me the embers don't look cool. Look at that for a shot. It's like fireflies or something. I'm just taking screenshots because this looks... <laughs> it looks great, I love it! Okay, one more screenshot. There we go. <laughs> Alright, let's go back to our ship. Now that we've seen how beautiful this looks, the embers look sick. I think it actually looks better than the first time, if I'm being honest. Yeah, I'll say it looks better than the first time. For sure! Okay, now that we've looked at this beauty with all its embers, let's get back to our ship and see how far away Lorville is. Now, I would say a long race for us in the org is about 60 kilometers away. I'm not quite sure how long this is. Ow, 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 ow. You're freaking kidding me. This is how I die. This is how I get stuck? Are you absolutely having a freaking laugh? I get stuck. I get stuck walking. Is how I get stuck. It doesn't matter where I am in the bloody burst. I get stuck on something. Get off this. Come on. You can do it. You're just on a cactus. For God's sake. I'm not coming. <laughs> I can't get off it, can I? What if I... I've done this before. Come on. Just get out of it. I'm trying to emote. Emotes aren't working. Trying to lie down. That's not working. Trying to shift. Trying to control. This is it, I think. What a bloody... I, how do I always get stuck? This is a little close to comfort. Hello, everyone. I, I did walked onto it. I didn't even jump onto it. I always find these spaces. All right, guys. If you come here, don't step on the stupid thing. Don't be an idiot. I'm going to have to suicide, I think. There's literally nothing I can do. I can use fists. God. Get your way out of here. I can't tell if I'm bloody moving. All I can tell is I'm fighting an invisible... Well, it's not invisible. It's a stupid freaking cactus. Ah! Don't get me! Save me! Don't hurt me! How do I get... <laughs> get out of this! Oh, wow. Bet this isn't what you thought was happening today, huh? I'm moving, I think. Oh, am I going crazy? Come on. 
think I'm moving forward, like, inch by inch. I don't think this is working. Guys. What the hell? Oh! Stupid, frickin', stupid. No, 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 don't go back into it. Don't go back. Just walk away. Walk away. Everything's fine. Put your little fists away. Ha! Ah. <laughs> How we got out of it? What the stupid shit are these things? Never again am I standing on you. I shouldn't anyway. Because I think when the game's out, you'll probably get hurt by these little badgers. You stupid sack of something. Alright, let's get back to our <laughs> shit. Keep away from those guys. They're not good. They're not good. Alright, it's almost night time. It still looks incredible. Let's go see the actual... Nah, you keep away from you, you stupid things. Um, let's go to our ship and see the distance. I'm hoping it's not too far. When we see the distance, if there's any community managers or anyone that's been a part of any of our org races in the past, let me know if this... I have a feeling it might be a little too far. But let me know what you think. From experience, if you've been in one of our races before, let me know if you think this will be okay. <laughs> let's see how far away it is. All right, guys. I've put Lorville on the map. Well, here we go. Moment of truth. Ninety-eight. Now, I'm pretty sure we've done races before that are eighty. I don't know if we've done a ninety. This is basically a hundred, but ninety-eight is the distance between. This is how long the race would be. So, what I need to do now, actually is head over to Edmund and see the distance between Edmund and Lawville. Because Edmund and Lawville, I'm told, uh, Night Raven said that is about a 30-minute race. So this is 98. Let's remember that. Okay? And let's have one last little look at this thing at night time. Because it does... It does look pretty goddamn sick, doesn't it? Look at it. That's cool. That's cool. All right, guys. Look at all this. Like, we're floating in the stars. All right, I'm going to get up out of the atmosphere here. It's bloody gorgeous. Look at that red sky. And we're going to head over to Edmund. And um, from Edmund, I guess I'm about to pass out. <laughs> from Edmund, we'll see how long that distance is. All right. So let me mark Edmund on the map and I'll see you guys when we get there. Edmund is right here, by the way. It looks like if you look at it, like it's a triangle. Look. So we, you can see where I am, over here. It looks like it may be similar. Because we're going from here to here. It's a bloody triangle, ladies and gents. So 98, which is weird because Edmund is closer. So let's get to Edmund and see how far this is going to take us. Let's go. Look at that, first of all. Look at that sun shining. Let's screenshot that. Bloody beautiful, if you ask me. All right, guys, we are here at good old Edmund. Let's just land her right here. I do like Edmund. Right here. All right, perfect. So this is Edmund. So let's see now the distance between Edmund and good old Lawville. All right, Lawville is the moment of truth. There you are. So that's 68. So it's 20, 000, 20 more kilometers away. So 68 versus 98. So, so I'm thinking it's not going to take too long. I think it'll take... I think, I think it's okay. Let me know what you guys think. I'm pressing buttons that I shouldn't be pressing because I'm so used to... You know, if I make a video on the Space Engineers and then Star Citizen and then Space Engineers, every day I jump into each of the games pressing the wrong buttons for the other game. <laughs> it's a bloody disaster! But, um, yeah. So, okay, that's not too bad. 68 versus 98. I'm pretty sure we've done an 80 kilometer one before. I know we've done a 60. Well, obviously, we've done... The org has done this before. 68. Let me know right now in the comment section down below. Is that something that you think is too far, 98 kilometers, or not? Because I don't, I don't know. I, sh I could test it, but I'm not going to because I don't want to cheat. If we are going to do this race, I want it to be my first experience with you guys as well. Again, this is an org event tomorrow, Saturday. 
10.30 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. Tune into my YouTube stream. Make sure you're in the Discord first. Link in description. All that good stuff. So how long would it take in a ship? Should we test that at least to see the distance? I'm going to test it. Okay, I'm going to go right now. Three, two, one. I can see Lawville. You can literally see it. I don't know if you guys can see it. It might be too dark on your screen, but my I think my gaming monitor is a little bit brighter. I can see it. I can see it in front of me. We are going to be going to gate one, though. We're not going to be coming in here. Gate one is just over there. So it's technically going to be even closer. Not by much. But that took me two minutes <laughs> in a ship. So two minutes isn't bad, obviously. But this thing's pretty quick. But, um... So it's going to be a little closer than Lawville. So I'm going to say 90... In the night, low 90s, right? Uh, instead of 98. Because I'm pretty sure... It's like right over here, the gate. Let's go check out where the gate is. Is it like around here somewhere? It's pretty lit up, right? Is this it? Is this light gate one? Oh, the front door, am I being... What the hell just happened? Was I being pulled? Or did my game just decide it was gonna decide to do that? I've never seen that before. All right, this is gate one. Okay, it's autopilot. I get it. I get it. Gate two's over. Th Are you having a freaking laugh right now? Don't you get me stuck on these stupid things. They follow me around everywhere, guys. They're bloody everywhere. Be careful. They're freaking everywhere. All right. And then this is gate one. So coming to gate one, you know, it's pretty easy. You got this big beacon, especially if it's nighttime to see where you're going. But this is where we're going to be starting the race. I think this is going to be good, you know. Sorry, Gladius. I think this is going to be good. What we're going to have to do is I'm going to have to fly over in my ship tomorrow morning. I'll land at the new location or I'll land over. Hold on, let me get a little closer then I'll explain it. All right, here we are. Gate one, ladies and gentlemen. This looks familiar. We were just bloody well here yesterday, weren't we? What's going on, guys? How are we all doing? Having a great day? That's what I thought. All right, guys. So this is the plan tomorrow. I've already, I've already forgot what I was going to say. This, this is good. Oh, so how are we going to do it? So what I'll have to do is tomorrow in the stream, when I first log on, before the racing starts, we're going to have to get in my Gladius. We'll do this together, and then we'll go on over to... I'll fly to the location, right? And I'll leave my Gladius there. Hmm. That's the only way that I'll be able to see it, though. No, so what we'll do... We'll do that, we'll do that. So I'll get my Gladius, I'll fly over to the location tomorrow, then I'll have someone come and pick me up from my ship, fly me back um, to Lawville, and then whoever's going to be at the end, you know what I mean? Like at the finish line of the race, I'll fly them over to my ship. And then they can stay there. And then someone's going to have to pick me up again and bring me back to here to gate one. That should, should only take minutes. It's not that far away. So that's the plan. So in the stream tomorrow, we'll fly there and we'll get it. We'll find it together on stream. And then someone will pick me up, take me back here. And then someone, whoever's going to be anchoring the race, or not anchoring it, but waiting at the finish line, they can fly over. I'll fly them over to where the finish line is. And then I'll have someone pick me up and bring me back. That way, they'll be over there and we'll be able to see their names. Does that make sense? It makes sense. It makes sense. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, guys. So that's going to do it for this video. It wasn't like a typical video. I just wanted to scout out the location. Uh, make sure it's okay. And then also get your feedback with the questions I asked in the video, if you don't mind. Just about the distance of the race and all that stuff, basically. Um, so that's it. Make sure you're in Discord. Like I say, link in the description. We're going to try not to pull anyone, like, from stream tomorrow. Uh, just because it takes away from the org event, having to add new people. And it's just, you know, it's difficult. We don't. I don't know what's going to happen yet. But if you're watching this and you want to play in the race... <laughs> 
Yeah, link in description. Appreciate it. Anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day, and I'll see you tomorrow morning with our org live event streamed on my channel. And um, I hope to see you guys there. I hope you enjoy the rest of your day, and I'll see you tomorrow in the live stream. Goodbye! <laughs>